Hey YouTube, my name is Jason, uh, and I guess welcome to my uh, new, soon to be released to you, YouTube channel. Uh, it's always kind of hard to figure out how to start a channel, I think, at least when I thought about doing this before. And so I just wanted to welcome you and take a little bit of time to talk about myself and what this channel is going to be all about. Obviously, you can see by the name, uh, it's outdoor overland focused, or will be that. I don't know if my approach is going to be different, but it feels a little different to the channels that I usually watch uh, in, in the overland off-road kind of sphere. And, and for me, it was kind of like, what am I hoping to accomplish by this? And, and if you knew me, I don't feel you'll get to know me a little bit. Um, for the course of this channel, uh, I'm a family guy. I got five kids, three of which reliably I can get camping. My wife sometimes. Uh, I like to go on adventures. I've always really liked to travel, and I'll talk about some of that more in future episodes. But in terms of what I plan on talking about with this channel, uh, obviously in the overlanding sphere, which I guess I would find myself in, I think time ago you would have called it maybe car camping um, but now it is adventure travel and now that my kids my youngest just turned four getting a little older we can it's much more easy to take them on trips uh, in fact I just left uh, an hour ago uh, an overland bound meetup in central Virginia near the Blue Ridge great bunch of folks so this channel uh, will be kind of a discussion of uh, probably a lot of it initially will focus on my vehicle. So about two-ish months ago, I got what for me right now is my dream rig. Uh, see, I'm an, I'm an overlander because I can call it my rig. Uh, I picked up a 2021 Ram 2500 Tradesman with the Power Wagon package, which for me, being a dad with a big family, to do a lot of home improvement, super convenient to have a pickup truck. And I'll talk more about my um, previous Overland experience, I had a Ford Excursion, and why that was, a, I love that vehicle, but why it really didn't work for me, or like, and how we kind of have to evolve uh, as our life and our family changes, um, and the plans that we think we have, and the rigs we build around those plans don't always work out. So a lot of it's gonna be talking about my, for all intents and purposes, my Ram Power Wagon, why I picked it, why I was so focused on this, the good, the bad. It seems like kind of an underserved market. There's a lot of videos out there talking about how great it is as a rock crawler. I think the argument that I'm hoping to make, uh, and some of it remains to be proven, is why I think it could be a really great North American overlander. So there'll be some focus on that. I'd like to say I'm gonna capture a lot of my adventures with my family. We're gonna do our best. Because what I don't get to go out all that often, I don't want to be spending all of my time flying a drone or filming like a lot of other folks could do. Uh, I don't really think that I have the eye or the cinematography background to do that. I'd love to have it someday. But for right now, I think it's gonna be a lot of rig focus, plans focus, kind of my thoughts on a couple different issues in the overlanding off-road sphere, maybe making the argument why full-size, or in this case, heavy-duty trucks, are something you should consider because it's a very Jeep and Toyota heavy market. I just wanna throw something else out there. So my aim uh, initially is to kind of pound out three, four, five videos up front talking about the vehicles. If you like uh, heavy-duty off-road overlanding, if you like Ram, overlanding, if you like Ram 2500, or even Power Wagon, overlanding off-road modifications, and not just chucking parts of things, because I'm a, I'm a family guy with five kids. Uh, I'm not gonna just take my wallet and chuck it at it, like I might have with my previous uh, diesel excursion. Part of the reason why I got this truck is because it's largely for a stock vehicle. Um, I keep it stock and not to do a whole lot to it. Anyways, but for example, I just put almost 35 inch tires on the vehicle. I actually want to keep track and see for you uh, exactly how much of an MPG hit uh, that's going to mean. Uh, 
I've got some lighting upgrades planned. I've got a skid, skid plate, intercooler cover from CJC Off-Road in my garage. I want to install that, see what that does. I'm going to end up putting a topper on the back of the truck, um, maybe eventually a tent on the top, and just chart my build progress. Take, kind of ex Also, I, I haven't mentioned this, I live in the Northern Virginia area. And so the Blue Ridge is not that far away, two hours, uh, to some decent off-road, you know, overlanding, forest roads kind of areas. But I kind of want to explore the area, because again, I think it's an underserved market. I see a lot of overland looking rigs, or a fair number, in my area. I, I'm i curious to where all these people go. Northern Virginia, DC metro area is a very atomized area. People don't really want to talk to each other that much, which is why I was so excited to be able to drive two hours away uh, to Central Virginia and meet up with other fellow overland founders. Uh, and just kind of hear a lot about where they want to go, areas that they want to experience. And hopefully that will prove uh, interesting uh, to you as well. So if you like to car camp overland with a big family, how you kind of deal with that um, or make accommodations for that. Or if you go out with your wife, maybe she's not 100% keen on going out in the woods, this will be the channel for you. If you uh, like to talk about or hear me, maybe, talk about um, the pros and cons of various modifications for your heavy duty truck, Ram heavy duty truck, power wagon, not in terms of a parts cannon approach, but in terms of like, hey, what does doing this actually mean for follow-on effects uh, on the vehicle, on its durability, uh, maintenance, whatnot, on your channel. So that's kind of my initial goal right now. Uh, I look forward to having you uh, join me on this journey. Uh, but most importantly, it's not just for you, the people of YouTube, or insert uh, out outdoor adventure, overland focused consumer. I want this first and foremost to be for my kids. So they can look back and see. I remember when dad had the big blue truck, which I will do a walk around of. Uh, I remember the fun times we had with that because for me, um, I have fond memories of going out with my dad he had all of these plans for going to Alaska, driving the Elkin Highway, and basically overlanding before it was cool in the 1980s. And unfortunately, he was never able to make that happen. I don't want the same thing to happen to me, and I want to be able to share that with my family. So if nothing else, this will be a vlog for the family, and they can make fun of Dad, and or look back, hopefully YouTube survives, some parts of YouTube that I would rather not survive, but um, for some fairly family, family friendly, wholesome discussion, uh, sharing adventures, maybe helping other people find cool areas to go in the DC, Northern Virginia, Central Virginia, maybe Maryland area, uh, or tracking the build progress of my truck. Please stay tuned, like and subscribe, like everybody always says, and uh, welcome. I hope to see you out there. Thanks a lot.